Y'all remember when the KFC Double Down was first announced and released back probably over 10 years ago now? It was announced on April Fool's Day. Some people thought it was a joke probably. And then it was actually released a couple weeks later. Everyone was freaking out saying it was like, oh my God, this is too outrageous. This is overboard. Uh, maybe that's not exactly how it happened, but that's how my mem memory has it. And uh, I was like, yeah, it's not really that crazy, but... Why is everyone freaking out? Anyway, today I have two double downs here. Actually, these are slightly different. They are double down maxes. I picked these up for $13.13 for both of them. Not a bad price. These are humongous boxes, by the way. And uh, I'm going to be turning one of them into a regular sandwich that no one would freak out about, I think. Let's unbox these first and see what we're working with. All right, so we have the box and then we have the we have a wrapper as well. So a lot of uh, packaging there. The Double Down Max, I believe this is actually the uh, full official name is the Zinger Double Down Max. I think this is a sp specific to Korea sandwich right here. And here we go. We got two pieces of fried chicken as the buns and we have some kind of sauce. We have bacon, cheese. And the max signifies that these have hash browns in them. Now, this is the only one I could find. I would just get a regular double down. But I think this is all they have these days over here. I'm not really sure. But this is all I can get my hands on. And like I said, I'm going to be turning one of these double downs into a regular sandwich. A little bit messy. A little bit sloppy. There we go. Double down. Absolute insanity. Double chicken sandwich. I gotta say though, that is pretty large. Uh, so yes, let's get into this. First, I'm gonna try out the regular double down or the Zinger double down max and see how it eats. See, uh, catch the flavors, catch the, catch the vibes of it. Mm. They took their jolly time delivering this, whoever it was. So, nothing you can really do about that. But, um, yeah, that's, that's, I like that. I'm pretty hungry right now. And that's hitting the spot. It's got that good KFC flavor. We can try to take a little bit of a closer look here, but you're probably not going to see too much detail in that. It is kind of just an amalgamation, to be honest with you. I like it. The cheese comes through. Um, it's got that thickness. It adds a thickness to it. The chicken, like I said, has that KFC flavor. Classic. Um, good sized pieces of chicken. Bacon, eh, I'm not really getting much bacon on this, to be honest. You just have salsa on them. Don't mind it. And, um, and yeah, so let me just start by saying it's messy. And I was going to go on a little rambling session, a little bit of a rant um, about something that I actually don't really care about, to be honest. But after eating this, okay, I can see it is a little bit crazy because of just the eating factor. I don't know if it's just my particular KFC around me, but it's not a particularly easy to eat, uh, clean eat. Usually the point of a sandwich is to have something nice and clean to hold on to on the edges, aka a bun. Or bread. Sorry. Or bread. And so I guess it is a little bit wild in that in that way, but not really. Let me try this one real quick. This one's a, this is actually a monster sandwich right here. Yeah. Alright, let me try this one and see what this is on.
Hmm. Yeah, I like that. It's more, it, it eats more like a regular sandwich. My hands are less messy. That is just one or two bites, but um, I can definitely see how the eating experience of this would be cleaner. But here's what, I'm gonna go on this rant. Like I said, it might be completely unfounded. It's, um, it's actually might not even be true and I actually don't care about it. But like people, I remember, People were definitely freaking out when this came out. Like, oh my God, that's so excess. It's the problem with America these days, eating these, making these super unnecessary, unhealthy foods. Well, yeah, but I mean, how long has it been since the double cheeseburger was invented, right? You put a bun on this, you add extra stuff, calories, carbs to it, and then it becomes just like a double chicken sandwich. Double cheeseburgers have been normalized for years, centuries even perhaps. Double chicken sandwiches all of a sudden, double chicken could, yeah, I guess chicken is fried, but some could make a case that chicken is healthier than a burger. I don't know. Maybe some people might make that case. Um, maybe not KFC perhaps per se, but, but still, you do this and then all of a sudden it's just a double chicken sandwich with bacon and cheese, which you know, let's be fair, on a good double cheeseburger, you're probably going to have some cheese. You're definitely going to have cheese and you might even have some bacon. So, what was the big deal about the double down then? I mean, look, these days, oh, well, I don't know. I've seen it before, though. I've heard about it where you'll, you'll get order something protein style, like a burger. And instead of a bun, they'll wrap it in lettuce. So you get order like a double cheeseburger, but protein style, I think. It's, it's probably like a California thing, uh, but they'll give you like a piece of lettuce instead of the bread. Well, this, it's, it's the same thing. You know what I'm saying? Except with chicken. Is it not? I, I don't know. Like I, said, I don't have a point, but my whole point is that, like, why why was everyone freaking out over this for no reason when it's just a double, it's a healthier version of a double chicken sandwich. I mean, I mean, it's still a KFC greasy, you know, processed full of salt, sodium, uh, and other things, mystery ingredients product. But say like, I don't know, any burger chain, fast food chain came with a, double, a new double burger. No one's blinking an eye. I don't know, I don't know what I'm saying anymore, but I'll tell you what, the amount of chicken you get is actually uh, very impressive to me. And I really do like it with this bread. It makes it a lot easier just to pick up and handle. Mm, actually, not that much. Not that much of a difference. I just like bread. But, but yeah, I mean, KFC, I don't know. It is what it is, I guess. Anyway. That rant actually uh, went quicker than I thought it would, so, you know, I'm just going to enjoy the rest of these double downs, one being just a double chicken sandwich. By the way, why aren't double chicken sandwiches a thing? Hmm. All right, y'all. So sorry if I went off the rails there. I, I'm not really sure how that will come across. I never do until I edit, and still I don't know. 
I, I don't know why I did this video. Now that I think about it, uh, there was no controversy or debate going on, but I just kind of pretended like there was one. That's a little bit weird, but maybe it was just a an excuse to try a double down with buns, bread buns. Uh, it's pretty good. Little slightly slight improvement over this, in my opinion. But I'm just getting out of here. Thanks for watching. I'll catch you in this video. Peace.